Hello everyone, Bleachbone here, and welcome back to more oh, uh, Kingdom Hearts Reaching of Memories. Part of the Kingdom Hearts Chronological Marathon. Floor 9! Who are you talking about, Donald? I don't know any girl named Kai. I mean, I know a character named Kai from Vanguard, but that's a boy. Anyway. Onward... ...to Hollow Bastion. Now, this one's gonna be interesting. It's not that hard, I'd say, but it's pretty much what we remember where we actually finish the game. We finish Kingdom Hearts 1, or close to it. There's no the e end of the world here. We'll have to leave then. Oh, well, not. Not really leave, but. Yeah, poor beast. Poor beast. Anyway, let's see what... Oop. Blue Hearn's here. Right. If I can hit them, that is. Gotcha. Come on. No! Oh, ow, that... Come on, Donald. Heal me. Thank you. Now attack. Thank you. Good, Donald. Good duck. Yep. Time for... Oh. Points. I but Did... Ah, yep, defenders. These guys that love to block the uh, front. And oh, and wizards can't forget these. But they love casting spells and pretty much absorb all forms of magic. Oh yeah, time to crush. Come on, battering ram! I'll batter you with Goofy's head! Ow! Oh god, you will not corner me into here! Come on, Cloud! Heh. <laughs> Too easy. I mean, admittedly, I am very high leveled. But that's not what's dealing the damage here. It's the amount of cards I have. Whoa, really? The Defender Enemy card? 
Yeah, that doesn't help me that much, but cool. That gives Protect, which is the physical version of Ursula's V card. I, it's good. Somewhat, but I wouldn't recommend it 100%. Okay. All right. Let's continue on. Okay, that was actually close. I could have died there. Yikes. Oh, God. Hi. Damn it. All right. Is that every enemy here? That is every enemy. Huh. What? Oh, right. You. If I hit that, I will start that up. So that would be like another way up here. But I didn't take it. Anyway, the map is actually fairly simple and straightforward. And this time we are going to be heading to the key to rewards room, so let's begin our trek there. Hmm, what to start with? I'd rather not use the big heartless rooms until I can absolutely know if I'm going to need them, because something's telling me with that I might not need them. Oh god. Gotcha! Okay, let's see what's next. What? <laughs> Let's see who else is here. Oh. Yay, points. Oh, this, you can turn off the fire, jump on, and that's how you get the stuff here. Okay. Now let's... Ah, uh, what? <laughs> and what's next? Oh. Because it's still just a straightforward path. Wow. Come on, Cloud. Why did you miss so much? Oh my god. <laughs> well, it's talking because I did get a level up. So let's finish these guys. That was. I thought that was going to end it there. But of course, Cloud missed everything. Wow. Wow. Just wow. Anyway, ooh, new slide. Ars Arcanum! It's a tough move to use, because you have to have between 1 to 6 value. This is good if you have the attack bracer on, but getting the value is kind of tough. Anyway, let's see what... This door will take us to. Oh right, I keep forgetting. I forgot, folks. Whoops. We need to do one of these. This kind of bounty offers three chests. Two of them are enemies. One isn't. No, the chests will not disappear if you get the wrong one or the right one. So you can still fight everything. Oh. Okay. Who's... Oh, come on! I hit him with a freaking best of So why am I getting so many copies of the Shadow Enemy Card? I don't need that. Oh, come on again! I am losing cards because of the stupid backswing. Don't attack the... Stop swinging the door. That's not how we open doors in this game. Okay. And we bring that so we can get up here. This is kind of why I'm glad I'm not using the big enemies, because I'm going to have to probably go through here, then up here, then around, then down. And reconnect back to here. Connect to there, and then... Blah, 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 blah. Yep. That's how at least I'm seeing it. Anyway. No enemies up here. But 
one enemy up here. One enemy I can't hit. <laughs> okay, so that enemy's gone. Now we have to choose, I believe, which treasure chest we need, want to pick. Oh wait, is there? That's the only thing that was here, so that means we cleared all the enemies I want to say. That is a affirmative. Wow. Okay. Anyway, three treasure chests. Two are enemies with inside, the other is real. What's this one? Crap! Okay, let's take a second chance. I'm gonna actually pick up a coin here for left and right. I wanted to go for the middle first. Heads will be right, tails will be left. It fell on my leg. So tails it is. Come on, be good! Damn it! All right. So now that we know that the first two I picked were just monsters, as in heartless, and I pretty much. have at this point determined that I have the worst luck to that. <laughs> okay, anyway, let's see here with what we get the real prize. Reflect Raid. <coughs> with a cloud end the two commits. This one will ricochet around enemies to just bounce around everywhere. It will bounce off enemies to hit other enemies. It's decent, but there's a better move than it. Anyway. That's the boss room, which means we're gonna have to actually... I don't have to turn this. I could go this way. Straight down. Come around. Turn that to a save point. Turn this to something else. And yeah, that can work. But let's see what our normal prize is. Because I think this one does have two chests as well, in both versions, I think. The GB one said Omni Slash, yeah. but you technically get that when you get your first Cloud card. So I'm not sure if this one has another yeah. prize as well. It might just be Atlantica with only two for the PS2 version. If I'm wrong, we'll get something we already got. Otherwise, let's see what this is. Yep. Yep. Okay, then. Actually, I, I don't want to go that way, so that means I could just... Yeah, that actually works in my favor. Hmm. What do you know? Let's see, what do we have for this one? Okay. This is actually a tough spot I'm in because I am running out of cards. and cards I can use decently. Alright, let's see how this goes then. Alright, 
This thing I love. Gotcha. Yeah. That went well. Now wait for you to sit. Yeah. Spawn again. Zap you. Gotcha. Now I'm obviously not going to be able to lure them to this trap all the time. Like that guy's too far away. And I can try, but let's see how this works. Nope! Which means I'm going to have to do this the old fashioned way of smack them with the keyblade. Gotcha! Hey! More CP! I'm gonna be conserving as much as I can for a little enemy card I know that's coming up that is actually pretty good. It's good for this kind of run. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Did I just see seven thousand EXP needed before next level? Ah, yeah. oh, come on! Alright. Oh, hi! Gotcha. Alright. Jumping up here to advance on more. I missed my jump? Okay, let's try again. Yeah, there we go. I forgot I had to glide. I'm just not used to gliding in this game that much. Oop. Gotcha. Yeah, I am the 7,000 of the XP needed before leveling up. Wow. Alright. Any more enemies? Yep. I missed. Oh, come on! Alright. Let's... Okay, that was bizarre. I got completely messed up in order. And I just realized I'm gonna have to loop around. There's no path here. Wow. That's the only intersection? That dumb. That's just so dumb. Hey, We'll save the roulette room, hopefully, for another time. <sighs> yeah, this is... library yep yeah there's a reason she can't show her real feelings And of course, we can't have Kingdom Hearts without our pretty much top Disney antagonist. Like when I first played this in the GBA, that's when I first came on the games, I was confused why Maleficent was involved with Belle and the Beast. It didn't make sense to me. But because these two didn't have their own world at the time, they had to do something like this for Hollow Bastion. Instead of just rehashing the first game. Yeah, 
now let's head on downward. Downward and out. To our next route that we're gonna go. And if I'm correct. Yeah. Just Really, I went in and I was trying to activate Okay game. That's how you wanna be. Fine. No. I am getting some of that EXP. So what I'm going to do that you apparently try to stop me from doing is make this room into a save point. So that way, I have it ready for the boss. Stuff to sell, more Muku points, that's always good. Let's just clear this up a bit. We're gonna actually save just so we are ready for when we tackle the boss. I'm gonna also probably let's see what other map cards it needs to get that out of the way since I've apparently been on a roll doing that. So that way, I only need to use the key of truth. You want just a one. Okay, have a teeming darkness there. And now we'll wait on you for a bit. And we're gonna save. Just so we have it ready. And now let's continue on. Onward this way. What? Fate continues for us. Hmm. Yeah, we'll do this. Let's... Oh god, hi, I almost about to do... I didn't hit you! I mean, we're getting there bit by bit. Ooh, careful. Ah! Uh, that was actually a good use of... Ow! Oh, wait. That didn't hit me. Wee! Hey there. Gotcha. Damn it! All right, that <coughs> was another bout. Let's zap you and get this through. That was a nice, easy chunk of experience. Hey, buddy, wanna come here? Shit! Mm-hmm. That one fails. I can't believe that failed. Anyway, is there a heartless here? No, there's not. Is there one up here? Likely, yes there is! Gotcha. Okay. Ah, nice, the Divine Rose. That's really nice. That's it. It was one of the best Keyblades. Alright! That was a nice level up. We got another long chunk to go, but that still means more CP for us. And we are now close to level 45, the level I want to be at before the end of this world. Alright, but we want to head up. I said we want to head up. Here and hmm. 
Let's actually adjust this a bit already. There we go. Do I have... There's a seven. And... Just need to get rid of that nine. But... I don't have a nine. I have an eight. But I guess that eight will have to do. And that pretty much finishes up that. That makes... My entire deck... Complete with just, well, except for the zeros, but that's fine for those being zeros. With just anything but the kingdom key. I can now deal some solid damage. Uh, which one do I want to, okay. Anyway, uh, guess we'll go with this again. You. Hey, gotcha. Alright. Didn't want that map card, but oh well. Hmm, 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 hmm. Oh, hi. Arrow. And what do you have for me? Health Forbes. Oh well. Alright. More enemies coming up! Well, this is a problem. Hi. There's the thunder. Uh, d d there we go. Thank you. No, you do not this time. I got you. And I got you. Oh, ho, ho. Hi, Wyvern enemy card. What do you do again? I completely forgot what you do. Uh, you... Stop the reload counter from counting reloads. Huh, so that pretty much means like it stays at one. It's all right, I guess, but eh, it only works once. Mm -hmm. And that is, I think, every enemy here in this room. Yep. That's a room clear. And this one shall take us to where? into a move room. We'll wait and see. For now, yeah, we'll do another one of this. As this one I can at least Abuse. All right. Gotcha. And 
Now let's see who's next. You. Oh wow, I'm almost almost there for this level. Oh god. Nice, nice, nice. This yeah. is really good. Oh, gotcha. Hey, tornado step enemy car. That's a new one. That one does what again? Subtract the reload to reload counter for two reloads. So it could turn a three to a, a one and a two to a one. And before you ask, no, it cannot turn a 1 to a 0. Basically, for 2 reloads, you could be at 1 for a while. It's not as good as it sounds. So close to leveling up now. I think you're the last enemy I need. Alright. That level gave us some more CP. Oh dear, there's another one of you! Oh god. Oh god, oh god. Shoot! Ah, uh, might as well just clear this last one. That finishes that one. What is next? Well, obviously, first, our final key towards room. Finally! It shall be opened. And we need a, something that equals two or more. Well, not two. It is exactly two. And we have this one. So now, with that, we have opened up the key to rewards. Simple rewards room for a very, very special treasure. And there's two treasure chests here. I will say this right now. If you're playing the GBA, there's only one. If you're playing the PS2, for those of you who are playing it, there's a PS2 version. You only need to beat both Sora Story and... Riku Story on any difficulty to unlock the second chest. If you're uh, in Japan, you'll need to complete Kingdom Hearts 2 Final Mix to unlock the second chest. And I think beat the game. Or it might just be that. If you're playing the... Pretty much... If you're playing... The 1.5... Or 1.5 and 2.5... Uh, PS3, PS4 versions. The second just will be locked if you complete the day's movie. Which I did. We're only getting one of the chests. Because we only need one of them. And the first one you open up will always contain Mushu. And we got it at a 9. This little guy on his own is not that good. But... The, one of the decks I've been planning. He will pretty much be a key asset. To pretty much big cloud control. Crowd control. Not cloud control. As for the other card, we're leaving it there. I don't remember what the key rewards one is this. I think it's a additional key play that you can get in days. I think it's the Midnight Roar, but we're not getting that. Nope. 
Not at all. Why am I trying to open another door? 